In this video we will discuss basic troubleshooting steps that you can complete if you experience network interference within your home. An effective troubleshooting step is to power cycle or restart your Wi-Fi router and machine. Restarting your router and your machine can refresh the machine's connection to your home network and provide a better experience. Additionally, if you have experienced any Wi-Fi outages or scheduled maintenance in your area, we recommend restarting your router and machine to help resync your devices. To do this, simply unplug the power cable from your router and turn off your machine, then leave them unplugged or powered off for two minutes. After two minutes, you can plug your router back in and turn on the machine. If you were previously connected to the internet, your machine will reconnect to your Wi-Fi without needing to sign back in. Another option that can be completed is clearing the app data on your console. This is a quick step that can resolve connection issues. To do this, click on the three lines to access the navigation menu in the upper left corner of the screen. From there, select Settings. Next, select Maintenance. After that, select Reset App Data, then on the pop-up menu, select Yes. Once the process is complete, you will be directed to the main iFit page, where you will select your language preferences before logging back into your account. For getting your network preferences on your console may also be an option that can resolve some connectivity issues. To do this, access the navigation menu and select Wi-Fi. Next, toggle the Wi-Fi off and then back on by selecting the radial slider. After that, press and hold the network name until a pop-up menu appears, prompting you to forget the network or cancel the action, and on the pop-up menu, select Forget. This will remove the network from your list of saved and connected networks. To reconnect, select the name of your network and enter your network password. If you want to test if your network configurations need to be adjusted on your local network, try connecting to a different network to see if you experience the same results. If you do not have another network connection available, try using a hotspot. After turning on your hotspot, access the navigation menu. From here, select Wi-Fi and select the name of your hotspot. If you do not see your hotspot name, toggle your Wi-Fi off, then on again with the radial slider as shown here. After that, enter your hotspot password and select Join. Once you are connected, test to see if you are experiencing the same results as you were on your local network. More information on how to turn on your hotspot can be found in the supplied links. For optimal connection, there are a few requirements to keep in mind. Your router should be no greater than 20 feet from your machine. If the distance between these items is currently greater than 20 feet, and you are experiencing any buffering or lagging throughout your iFit experience, we recommend that you bring the items closer together. If that is not possible, we recommend obtaining a Wi-Fi extender in the area closest to your machine. Additionally, our equipment network requirements may differ from the network settings that you have for your home network. To verify that your home network meets these requirements, we recommend that you go over this information with your internet service provider. The link to the network requirements can also be found in the supplied links. 